let's start. Oh, that looks different. Here we go. The intro is great to this, though. Hello there. Welcome to my planet. You won't be so welcoming once I take over your planet. That's not a very nice thing to do. I'm not a very nice guy. <laughs> Sam, are you cleaning your room? I was just about to get started, Mom. I really need you to finish that up for me, all right? Thank you. Boy, I have a lot of work to do. I don't know where all my stuff even is. It could be anywhere. This looks like a job for... Pajama Sam! Well, I suppose I should get started. I wonder what might be hiding under here. Whoa! Where did this come from? I bet a lot of my stuff is down here. I gotta go get all of it. Yahoo! Oh yeah, this is a weird title screen. Welcome everybody to Pajama Sam's Lost and Found, another junior arcade game, similar to Sockworks, but actually very different. It's very different from the other junior arcades, because it's kind of like a side-scroller almost. But yeah, Pajama Sam is continuing with his imagination <laughs> by just getting sucked under his bed, I suppose. Also, it looks like there aren't any even files, but rather you need to remember passwords. Oh, that's interesting. Let's go to options first. Unlimited lives, no obstacles. Decrease detail, obstacles spin you? Is that like hard mode? I think I'll just play with the default settings. This is the arcade game you've played by far the most. Oh, well, cool. I guess we'll just play then. Hi, Otto. It's great to see you again. You too, Sam. To what do I owe the pleasure of your company? I need to clean my room, and there are some things that are missing that I just know drop down here. Say no more. Let's see if we can track them down. All right, yeah. So we, we're in auto, and we can move back and forth. Up a bonus puzzle piece. And we can jump. We. Up a bonus puzzle piece. I forgot about the bonus puzzle pieces. Those lead to bonus stages. Which are the best part of any junior arcade game. A piggy bank! Okay, the uh, mouse controls on this are not the best. Can you keyboard control? You can keyboard control. Can you... Sp oh. Interesting. Yay, we get... Cool. I like bonus. We got half a bonus. No bonus for me. Aww. Oh yeah, sure enough, every, after every level you get a passcode. Well, because I'm streaming it, I don't even need to write these down. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. I, that literally just spawned on top of me. That's cool. This game is just... Re oh, Whirlpool! Wait, oh, we missed a bonus puzzle piece, I think. Darn it. Yeah, again, I have not played this really before, so... <laughs> You'll get sick of that sound clip very... Yeah, most likely. Yeah, I think I missed a bonus puzzle piece on that one. <laughs> got all the... Well, I got all the items, apparently. Maybe that doesn't include... Oh, man, I still can't play the bonus. Oh. Yeah, this seems like it's going to be a junior arcade game that maybe I don't want to play in large si large amounts in a single sitting, but definitely seems fun. Oh, man. Oh, wow. We can just fly now. This is great. The bonus puzzle piece spawned too high up. This is definitely really different from the other junior arcade games. It's 
doing the... Doggone! Man! I am very bad at finding all of the bonus puzzle pieces. <laughs> You not only need to dodge obstacles, you also need to collect toys. Miss one and you have to reset the level. Oh! I did not know that. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Apparently that rock kills you if you so much as look at it. Funny. What the heck? It's so easy to miss the bonus puzzle pieces. Do they have to play that sound clip after every single puzzle piece? The answer is no, but they uh, they chose to anyways. Oh man. Okay, so literally every single level has enough bonus puzzle pieces to get the bonus. I thought they were carrying over between levels. No, they are not. It helps if you go slow. No! Like Sonic said, you gotta go fast. Well, we came close. No, oh, I wanna play on the giant cookie! I don't need I don't need the passcode. We can just keep going. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. What does this do? I don't know what this does. Oh, we can jump on top of stuff. That's what it does. Yes, I know you did, Sam. <gasps> this is Man comic book! Yes, we need that. We finally got the freaking bonus puzzle. <laughs> finally! You got the bonus. Oh, is that what it's for? I thought it was just you get extra points. Yay, we finally got the bonus. Okay. So we can go... We can go play on a giant cookie, we can play a card matching game, or go here. I'm going on the giant cookie. Oh, this is not a giant cookie. when they jump out of the holes to get extra points. The game's over after you win five of them. Okay, this seems very simple. You can get a hundred of them? Okay, they're definitely going to start popping up at a faster rate. This is very easy. Maybe it's just because I'm an adult, or maybe it's because I've been playing backyard baseball, but this seems very easy. We're also in the first world, so... And it's also our first bonus game. They're like, wow, you're really bad at picking up the bonus puzzle pieces! <laughs> we can't... Okay, we gotta, we gotta get the shirt. Now they're coming out at a fast rate. Thank goodness they have larger hitboxes than it looks. I also want to point out that I can cheat at this and just pause ScumVM whenever I want. Sam, are you actually doing anything with the stuff that's in your room, or are you just like, I'm picking up a bonus puzzle piece? It's like, Sam, did you clean your room? No, but I got a bonus puzzle piece! <laughs> I don't know what that means, Sam, but that's not... Uh, that's not an answer. You got the bonus... <laughs> all right. I can imagine this game would be very long if you continuously got all of the bonus puzzle pieces. I feel like there had to be a better way of announcing when you get the bonus puzzle piece. Oh, apparently that was an enemy. I literally wasn't even given an option to not hit that. They're just like, your mouse was kind of on the right, so, uh, yeah, you die. Okay. 
Gotta pick up your... Uh, pa Pajama Sam, I don't know why there there's just an entire swamp under your bed, but you might want to look into that. I'm also probably a little too good at clicking stuff with a mouse. Dang, we already have 47,000 points, and we've been playing this game for like 10 minutes, maybe. Okay, well, maybe I'm not going back to the whack-a-mole. Let's go play a card game. Pick two cards at a time. If they match, you get extra points. If you don't match five times, the game is over. Okay. <laughs> this is cheating. <laughs> Watch me still mess up, though, with this. <laughs> yep. <laughs> is there a limit to how many? Yeah, there's free it left. Okay. I can also literally just screenshot stuff. Uh oh. <laughs> Cheater. Alright, I won't cheat. I'm still messing up even when I cheat, though. <laughs> well, that was really unimpressive! <laughs> I have a goldfish brain. Confirmed. That's you? Weird. Normally I'm good at memory games. Not this one. It's because I have an audience. Oh, almost fell on the rock! Those rocks have big hitboxes. Okay, anytime I hit something and like have to reset, they're like, you want to hit it again? It's like, no. Please, no. Oh, good. I, I got... I found another life. I... Wow. <laughs> wow, that thing has a big hitbox! That thing's hitbox must be just a full square. Yes, I know you did, Sam. It's very exciting. Speedruns of this game must be interesting. You, like, don't want to pick stuff up. Makes sense. I think that this is one of those junior arcade games where, like, I played, like, maybe ten levels of it, then I'm just like, this is kind of boring. Alright, let's see what this minigame's all about. Oh no, it's eggs away. Extra point after you miss five, the game over. Oh great, it's eggs away. At least this is more exciting than eggs away though. At least it has music. Also, does this game have original music? Because all of the music I've heard this far I think comes from either other pajama same games or like sockworks. I have never played the game long enough to escape from the auto levels, so that'll be interesting. Uh oh. Thankfully, the mouse controls in this game are a lot better than they are in Bear Stormin' or Circus Stormin'. Oh no. That crayon made quite a noise. Uh. Mouse does get stuck sometimes, though. No! Sorry, Rex. Wow. Blistering speed. So does this do these does this bit bonus game like have an end? Like the whack-a-mole game had an end. Or is this just like eventually if it moves so fast you literally can't catch it? There goes Sam's favorite yo-yo. Jeez, why can't my backyard baseball players throw baseballs that that hard? <laughs> Okay, I almost don't want to get all the bonus puzzle pieces now. <gasps> no! I didn't get all the stuff!
Poor Otto. I have one life left. I gotta be careful. Okay, that's just not even possible to grab right there. I got a new high score! Okay. Uh. So we got... I wish I could see. So we got pup Putt, Fatty Bear, Freddy, Loofer, Pajama Sam, uh... Mr. Fab, Otto, Pep, and Buzzy. Hmm. <laughs> hey, Mobius, welcome. <laughs> no, this is Pajama Sam's Lost and Found. Oh, wait. Oh, I got I got the high score already? <laughs> Interesting. I'm going to enter my name as Tim. That's not my actual name. But I'm entering Tim in honor of that one guy who had the high score in Frogger. He's back. <laughs> Anytime you start a new file, you got to beat Tim's high score. That's just how it goes. Wow, I got a, I got like seven times the score pup -Pup did, but pup -Pup made it to level 10. That's kind of funny. Buzzy scored 39. Oh, wait, shoot. I didn't write down the passcode. Oh, wait. It just remembers it for you. That's a, that's a good... See, that's good game design. I picked up a bonus yeah, you did. Doggone it! Pajamas to ham! I picked up a bonus but at what cost, Pajama Sam? Are you serious? The freaking log! <laughs> you had a bad day. The obstacles in this game have a very large hitbox. Wait, it lets me continue with my score. That seems kind of imbalanced. Oh no, I didn't get all the items. You suck. <laughs> I don't like- can I skip the bonus game? Oh, I- I can. I can skip the bonus games. Honestly, yeah, I don't really want to play the bonus games. They're not that fun. <laughs> These levels are very short. Wow, that level was so easy. Oh, upper right is the high score. Mm, sorry about that. I already beat Pup Putt's high score. You see, see this this game is about what I remember. I'm not saying the game is bad. It's more just this game is very repetitive, and there's not a lot of variety yet. But maybe that'll change. All the levels just kind of seem like they're the same. It's like, you play as Otto, jump over stuff. I picked up the bonus puzzle piece! Oh no, I hit Sharky the Yacht. <laughs> Good night, Metal Lord. Thank you for joining in. No, no, no! Oh no, the alligator staplers. The enemies are creative, I suppose. <laughs> How the heck are you supposed to get that 25? Okay, this game is definitely tricky <laughs> to get, like, absolutely everything in. I also wonder what the highest score anyone has ever scored in this game is. <laughs> hey, we're on level 11. Does that mean it's going to be a new world? Doesn't look like it. Oh, man, I hate the logs. Actually, I hate all of the ground obstacles. Their hitboxes are way bigger than they should be. Look at that. You got a new high score. Tim will have every high score. Actually, no. In honor of Frogger 2, we will have... <laughs> Bruh... Gonna fill all the high scores with funny, dumb stuff. Um, 
That's what we want. Oh, so this this game has 20 level in world increments. How the heck are you supposed to get some of the items that are like on top of the logs? Is there like can we do like an attack move that I'm just not aware of? Are there any moves here other than jump that I'm not aware of? And that's, like, that would help me out. <laughs> I'm so glad that it plays a very long animation to me not getting the bonus level. Oh wait, that's an attack? I gotta try that out. I thought it was just... I thought it was just the whirlpools that make you do that. Uh-oh, that's not good. Hold on. No, hold on! Why did it resize my window for me? I don't like that. Great, now I have to guess what the new screen size should be. I don't know what I did, but apparently that happened. Ah, uh, there we go. I freaking hate how big these fiends' hitboxes are. What? <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on. Okay, I want to get this guy on screen. Okay. I am pretty. Wait, hang on. I am pretty sure this guy's hitbox is like, ch 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 like a massive square. <laughs> Hello, Nintendo addict. Yes. All right. Have a good night, DX. <laughs> I'm sure your dreams will be filled with bonus puzzle pieces. <laughs> oh my gosh! I died to that final obstacle like five times. You stink, because you don't know how to do all of the moves in the game. Yeah. <laughs> Congratu- Wow, they actually made bonus levels that aren't fun to play. Instead of having three different bonus levels, they should just have had one that actually was, like, really good. Like, look at the- how are you supposed to get the bonus puzzle piece if you don't- No, whatever. Okay, we're not bruh anymore. Now we're Chad. <laughs> As in Giga Chad. I'll try spinning! That's a good trick! The problem is, I don't know how to spin. Like, if you hit the geysers, you can spin? I don't know how to spin outside of that, though. And we're so proud of you for doing that, Sam. Okay, the mouse controls when you're flying are not great. Wee yeah. Get out of here, you stupid boat. Get out of here, boat cop. Yeah, but last time I moved my last last time I moved my mouse below, it resized my window for me, and I didn't like it. For the next passcode, name it Sans. Good good idea. <laughs> That was a long level. Okay, we at least gotta make it to level 20 tonight. We can do that. And if this... Okay, if this level's only... If this game's only 100 levels, we can beat it in, like, two free streams. I guess depending on how long we play back here in baseball. Oh. 
How about a nice football? <laughs> oh, funny meme. Okay. Okay, sure enough, that's how you do it. That's how you're supposed to get rid of a lot of these obstacles. I feel like maybe there should be a better way of doing that, but... I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. It bit! We did it! Oh, what a jerk move! <laughs> I mean, even if I had gotten that, I wouldn't have gotten all of them, but still. <laughs> and before anyone asks, I am not adding that as a sound alert. <laughs> Too obvious. I like how we get to explore the land of darkness again, but like, whoa! What? What? I didn't even come close to hitting that. Jamison did not want to spin there. That's that's physics. Wow, this is, um... This is one of the games of all time, I would say. Uh, oh, come on! The spinning is really wonky. Hang on. Okay, you can play on keep... Okay, I was playing on keyboard. Okay, we're playing on keyboard from now on. We did it. <laughs> Forget the mouse. Keyboard's the way to go. Use the arrow keys and then shift does literally everything else. Don't you want to play on one of these exciting bonus courses? No, I played them all. <laughs> Yeah, I believe it, because that's just the kind of site YouTube is, isn't it? Whee! Okay, it's it's a lot harder... Mm, actually, no. It's a lot harder to move the boat around, if you're using... It's easier to perform the spin, but it's really hard to actually move through the air. Oh, I thought that was something to pick up. Who would want to watch that? Alright. Here we go. Sans Undertale. Very funny, but Tim still has the high score. And he probably will for the rest of eternity. You would watch the whole ten hours? Really? That is kind of sad, if you would. You need to find a better use for your time. <laughs> but I was spinning! Who wouldn't? Most sane people would not. What? Okay, wow, we're getting into the Bear Storm and level difficulty already. Well, no, this is still not even close to Bear Storm and level difficulty, but. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. This game's difficulty is 10% level design, 90% bad hitboxes. No, it's not worse than Bear Storming. Oh, we can right-click to just skip all that? Oh, that's really nice. Wow. <laughs> the 
this will be just bad. <laughs> bad still is ahead of Chad, though, in terms of uh, high scores. So what I'm gathering is basically we should just always spin. I was spinning there. Wow, yeah, the hitboxes are way too big. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. Yeah, I know you did say I I feel like I need to use the mouse to move around and I need to use the keyboard to spin. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. You can't spin in midair. Oh no, you don't right click, you have to click both left and right click at the same time. I'm sure you did, Sam. Okay, yeah, the invincibility is the best power up. <laughs> That Kenny the yacht. I picked up a bonus puzzle. I didn't pick up all the bonus puzzle pieces, apparently. Oh, the double click is the same as the escape button on Scumbium? Did not know that. I guess I haven't tried pressing escape. Oh, no, 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 no! I. This game is infamous for resizing my screen for no reason. And unlike Hulk hands, I don't like it. Okay, I think that fixes it. Beep, 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 beep. Nope. This is so dumb how you can destroy bridges just by being like, oh, hey, I'm spinning. Did it resize my window again? For those of you who don't know, I am now playing most of the game with the mouse, but I'm doing the spinning with the keyboard. I'm not playing with the junior helper. That's the easy way out. Though it is probably more fun. I gotta get to level 20. Alright, this will be... Steve. From Blue's Clues. Our hero. It's playing the game with a mouse work better than playing with a keyboard. Here's the feign. I use both because it's way easier to do the spins on the keyboard because you just do down and shift instead of having to, like, you gotta hold the mouse down at exactly the right point on the screen and click and hope it doesn't resize. But everything else is easier on the mouse. Wow. That hitbox on this is ridiculous. I did the spin, and it just didn't spin. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. We are so grateful to you, of course. I picked up a bonus puzzle piece. Wow! He just was auto-jumping. I am not doing anything right now. He was automatically jumping over and over again.
I don't get the reference. I freaking... I don't like this game. <laughs> wow, this game sucks. I still got a high score for that? I got... Really? Apparently there are 100, so we can beat it, but... We will go with Stink. I am so proud of this. Even though Stink will leave the leaderboard eventually. 100 levels in the game, 5 locals, 20 levels each. Okay, then. Okay, the bridge's hitbox is like half the screen. Also, wow, spinning didn't even work that time. Do you have to spin and jump to get defeat the bridge? Okay, yeah, the spinning just sometimes don't work. Even when I'm using keyboard to make it easier to spin. I don't understand this game anymore. Okay, spinning just doesn't work. Cool, I will jump over everything, and I don't even care about getting a score anymore. I will get the bare necessities in order to clear the level. Wouldn't let me move back. beat Fatty Bear's high score with a incomplete level. Wow, this is... Mm. Yep, definitely one of the games of all time. Okay. This is freaking driving me crazy. If you click outside the window, it's just like, well, you're screwed. What the he I have to look at this in editing, because I wasn't even close to the bridge there. Even when you activate the spin, it just doesn't work half the time. Good game design. Like, they had an interesting idea with this game. I just feel like it could have been executed. Notice I didn't even say executed better, I just said executed. <laughs> I said... I said spin. Game tried to mess me up there. How long is this level? And how many times is the spin just not going to work? This, don't tell me this is going to be one of those trial and error gameplay. I swear the spin is broken. It Even when you input the spin command on the keyboard, it doesn't work half the time. Unless they introduce some new gimmicks, this game's going to be really not fun. Look at that! The spin is fundamentally broken. Even if you spin right on top of something, you still just might die because the game says no.
finish the level now. We did it. Finally! Oh yeah, you can just push escape. Okay. Alright, well this will be the last level of the stream. This has some cute ideas, like the uh, staplers that are alligators. That's pretty cute. The fact that you can't see what's at the bottom of the screen when you're at the peak of a jump and you have to be at the peak of a jump to get over a lot of obstacles, that's not a very good design. Oh yeah, that that's a good touch. But like, stuff like this, like, you... You don't get enough time to react to stuff. Because I had to jump over the first one... And, yeah, like, look at that! You just have to know it's going to be there. Which is, again, not, not good. Not good design. Alright. Uh, let's see. This will be... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Eight. <laughs> That'll be the last high score I enter. Yeah, like right here, you just have to know there are going to be all of those obstacles in the row. And likewise, you like you just have to know that second set is going to be there, and you just have to know that that periscope's going to be there too. And even if you do, it's a ridiculously tight window to jump over it all. Unless you hope that the spin works, which it only has maybe a 90% chance of working. Yay! Alright, tell you what, we will do one last bonus game. We will try the Remember game one last time. Pick two cards at a time. If they match, you get extra points. If you don't match five times, the game is over. I can get a couple of them, but once you get towards the end... Like, I can get half of them. I can't remember beyond that, though. Uh, FN Fairy, thank you so much for the follow! Welcome- Oh my gosh! Okay, what a passcode to remember for next time. Super Grover! Wow. That- what are the odds? What are the odds we end the stream on the password super? That's kind of amazing, actually. Don't you want to go? I really don't want to go. And I don't care about entering my high score, I don't think so. Well, Pajama Sam Lost and Found is certainly uh, a game that exists. <laughs> I, I'm having a little bit of fun, but man, I hope the level design picks up in the upcoming worlds, because otherwise it's going to be a, just a, a long stream series of the same thing over and over again. <laughs> you get a password like that every 20 levels. That's pretty cool. Alright, I can, I can get down with that. Thanks for joining in, everybody. This was definitely an interesting stream. So yeah, like I said, Wednesday, we will be finishing up the playoffs one way or another. If we beat the f next playoffs game, then we'll play more Pajama Sam Lost and Found. Otherwise, I don't have to wait till next week, and we'll probably stream Higurashi again on Sunday. And also, if we don't finish Higurashi on Sunday, we might be streaming Higurashi on Monday after that as well, because I want to finish it by Halloween, so... 
All right. Have a good night, everybody, and God bless.